Necro Sonnet! Today I'm going to show you how to add a Menafin game to Steam so you can launch the game from Steam, play it from there rather than doing the drag and drop as I normally do. Now if you haven't seen my tutorial video on how to set up Menafin, I suggest you go watch that now, otherwise this video will be utterly pointless to you. Now the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open the location of my Q file that I've shown you in the tutorial video. This is Castlevania Symphony of the Night. This is the Q file that we used. Um, we're going to need that in a bit, but uh, next thing we're going to do is go over to Steam, and there's two easy ways to do this. If you have the toolbar up top, you can go to Games, add a non-Steam game to my library, or conversely, down on the bottom quarter here, you have Add a Game. I'm going to click that, Add a non-Steam game. You're going to get this window here. Now, you are not going to see Menafin in this list of programs. At least I don't believe so. So I'm going to browse for the file, and we need to find the location of Menafin. And hopefully you followed my advice in the first tutorial video and uh, placed the entire folder for Menafin in an easy-to-find place. So I'm going to navigate to that folder location now. And there is the executable, menafin.exe. I'm going to hit open. You're going to see it in the list here. And I'm going to click Add Selected Programs. Now... This will add Menafin to Steam here. It's going to look real ugly. It's just going to say Menafin. But uh, we're not done yet. Uh, you click play. It's, it's not going to do anything for you. Now I'm going to right-click Menafin, go to Properties, and this is the meat of our tutorial here. This target is the Menafin executable, as it should be. But we also need to tell Steam that we are using Menafin to open a specific file and that file is going to be the Q file so to make this easy for this tutorial video I'm going to open up notepad here don't think I need to explain what notepad is um, I'm going to open file explorer again to what we opened at the beginning of the video this Castlevania Symphony of Night folder I'm just selecting this file path here and I'm going to copy this to notepad so first thing I'm going to do is hit the quotation mark, we need that in there. Right click, paste that file path. I'm going to add a backslash at the end of that file path. Back over to my folder here. I need the name of the Q file. So I don't want to go too fast here. I'm right clicking the Q file, going to properties, and I'm just copying this here. This is the actual file name. Back to notepad paste that in and slap a quotation mark on the end there so this in quotation marks is the full file path and file name of Castlevania Symphony of the Night so I'm going to select all of that right click and copy again I'm going to minimize all this stuff to get it out of the way now click the end of manafin.exe right after that quotation mark I'm going to press space once and then I'm going to paste in what we just copied from notepad. So I'm going to grow back over here. You're going to see the full file path there. It's uh, Castlevania Symphony of Night directly after menafin.exe. Simple as that. Now, oh, and now would be a good time to rename this. So I'll just throw in Castlevania. Simply the night. Close that. And now in Steam, I have Castlevania there. I can hit play and this will fire right up for me. Just like that. Piece of cake. Now you can repeat this process as many times as you want. It's not going to yell at you for adding Manafin again and again. Um, this doesn't break any functionality in Manafin. The saves still work. I haven't had any issues so far. So um, I will say you're going to see in the bottom right corner right now that uh, Steam is kind of freaking out. Uh, to get rid of that little blurry window thing, I'm just hitting Alt-Enter. 
and that reduces the full screen, hit Alt, Enter again, that goes back to full screen. Same as I've shown in the previous tutorial video. But uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, I really appreciate all of your comments on the Manafin tutorial setup video. Uh, a lot of good feedback on there, a lot of questions. One of the questions was, how do I add a game to Steam and get it to run for Manafin? So that's what encouraged me to make this video for you here. And as a closing statement, uh, it sounds half desperate, but you know, it's YouTube. Everyone's a bit desperate. I'm not just doing tutorial videos on this channel. I have plenty of gameplay videos too, so do me a favor and go check one of those out. All right? Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.